Drake Bell speaks out in a candid new interview after the release of Quiet on Set. In People Magazine's exclusive look at the Man Enough podcast that Drake appears in on April 8th, the former Nickelodeon star explains how he's doing since going public with his story of the sexual abuse he suffered at the age of 15. Drake says in a podcast preview clip, the more that I'm able to talk about it and the more that I'm able to articulate my thoughts just for myself in my own mind, there is a big weight that feels has been lifted and is free. He shares that dealing with the trauma of the abuse led him to self-medicating, explaining, quote, I was not recognizing myself, saying his actions were just so out of character for not just who I want to be or who I want the world to see me as, but who I know I am and how I know myself. The Drake and Josh star also reveals he sought help in rehab. The full interview drops on April 8th, one day after a new episode of Quiet on Set is set to be released. In previous episodes, Drake told his story for the first time publicly, revealing he was the unnamed minor in the 2004 sexual assault conviction of acting coach Brian Peck. The former child star says in the film that the acting coach abused him over the course of months at his home. Peck was arrested in 2003. According to court records viewed by E! News, the acting coach now 63 was convicted of two charges that included lewd act upon a child 14 or 15 by a person 10 years or older and oral copulation of a person under 16. He served over a year in prison and was made to register as a sex offender. E! News has reached out to Brian Peck and Nickelodeon for comment but has not yet heard back. In a statement to NBC News, a Nickelodeon spokesperson previously said now that Drake Bell has disclosed his identity as the plaintiff in the 2004 case, we are dismayed and saddened to learn of the trauma he has endured and we commend and support the strength required to come forward.